thank you very much for clicking on my video. Whilst most people want a sea view out of the hotel rooms, not me. I'm a boater. What view do I want? The southwest largest chandlery. Let's go. So we're going to go and check out the southwest largest chandlery shop. I'm going to be like a kid in a sweet shop. I can't wait. <laughs> oh. Exciting times. Speaking of the devil, it's a chandlery shop. Are you coming? <laughs> so uh, James is excited too. He's coming to the chandlery. Southwest largest chandlery shop. Hey! There it is. There it is. Look, he's flexing. He's flexing the plastic. I'm so excited about this. It, you know, it's funny and it just simple things, and I'm going in. Look. Oh, that's got a clutch. Oh yeah. Some people find that an easy fix. But yeah, this is this is got clutch. That one seems alright, but I find the pulling a bit heavy. Yeah, because it's stuck on prop. Cheeky little seagulls. Who's well, interested in this little seagull? He's already got about three of them. Yeah. We might need that for tomorrow. I think you better swat up tonight. That looks like fun. Um, they're not guaranteed working or anything, it's just... Oh no. Once that's done, once that's done. James is interested in one of the seagulls over there. He's managed to get some money off. I think he's just walking around thinking about it. He's going to end up buying it. He'll end up buying it. He's bought it. He's got it. Did you get it? I bought them for 10 quid, I bought them for 50. He's happy, he's got another one to his collection. <laughs> Thank you very much for Marine Bazaar in Plymouth. Sorted James out with a cheeky little seagull. I got a couple of springs at a fantastic price. Really friendly staff in there, guys. Get in there, honestly. It's like an Aladdin's cave. There is so much stuff. And, you know, you can get some good deals from them as well. They're really approachable. But James walked in to buy, what were you going to buy? I think a spark plug or something. And comes out with a seagull, so, yeah. He's happy. Should we test it out now? Should we, should we run it on the street? Has it got fuel in it? It's got fuel in it. I think he's actually on about actually giving it a test. Stay tuned. Pull it out. Sorry. <laughs> Sadly, we couldn't get the seagull running straight away. It stunk of stale fuel, so we wanted. Obviously, it was good. It would have been funny and epic if it would have started straight away. But they had been sat there for ages. You could smell the fuel was stale. So um, we're going to drain the uh, tank, check the spark. But yeah, another seagull saved. Just down in Plymouth now. We're going to have a bit of a seagull get together. So um, stay tuned for the other video and see how we all get on. So uh, fingers crossed, none of us break down. I'm sure we won't. It's a lovely seagull. So. Cheers for watching. Bye.